we got a Holly 600 vacuum secondary manual choke 1850 dual external float adjustments irregardless it's got to have three pounds of pressure just like everything else does you try to run it with any more than that don't send it back don't try to me and don't call any kind of ether, starting fluid, propane, or any other kind of crap around this carburetor because it needs to finish off and to blow your motor up to boot. Your motor is hesitating, you probably got slow timing, you want 30 degrees at 3,000. Air fuel ratio of 12 to 1 to start out with. And that's exactly what you got right there. The ideal mixture right there, 12 to 1 to make a good clean burning flame. Inside or outside, 12 parts of air to one part of fuel. Oh boy, as soon as you accelerate, it starts spinning out. You got a back barrel back there. And you notice as you accelerate it, as you accelerate, it gets thinner. You don't need as much liquid squirting in there. You can get by with a thinner mixture. We check to see you got plenty of suction, suction for your vacuum advance, for your distributor or windshield wipers or whatever you want to put on them. I assume you got one over here for your brakes or PVC valve. This one here is for Chevrolet General Motors or Ford with manual transmission. This does not NOT. This does not have a Ford kick down. So you can't use it with a Ford automatic unless you unless you tell us and then we can bolt an adapter on here for an additional $20 where you can use it on a Ford. Otherwise, it's set up right now for General Motors.